they call it brave key default i'll tell you what if they have the monk class in uh in the sequel i'll do an all an all monk running that or if not i'll just do it later in this game I, I, I never knew this game had challenges like that or fan made challenges like that shit right now. Um. So that gate is open, so we're good down there. Sleep blade, hold on. That might be something I can get to rig a bell. Blade that rarely causes sleep. That's damn near his. Yeah. I, I should have gave that to rig a bell, but he's strong enough as it is. I damn, I got everything maxed out, so I'm just like, I'm just. Oh, we gotta go to the middle. Duh. Spirit bone. No more of that. Let's, uh, we gotta go up from somewhere. Did I just skip my? I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. I just noticed. I just noticed that it was a. That area that I went down to, it was a, a staircase behind me.
we go. Oh God. You got so much damn health, it's ridiculous. Even with me be the fact that it's like it, it takes me like three hits to knock out somebody that I can that you know when, when I'm at maxed out stats, that lets me know that eventually I'm my level and my stats just won't matter later on. What the hell am I doing? I got maxed out. Uh, what you call them? Uh, teleport stone. He reminds me of like that dude. He reminds me of like some. I can't remember what game it came from, but he looks like a a minion from one of those games. Researching how to make a neutralizing agent. Wait, would you consider destroying that sample now? On oh, yes. I understand the need for a cure for the poison, but I would like you to dispose of that sample. Find a method that ensures it can never again be used. 
You can incinerate it in the lava. Yes, I see. If there is no danger the toxic mist will be used again, then we have no need to neutralize it. That would also remove the temptation to use the sample to turn the tables on our enemy. I do not have the resolve to say with full confidence that we could prevail without it. Therefore, I will gladly do as you ask, Gwynvestal. Let us throw this master sample into the lava. I thank you for accommodating my request. I am happy that my words fell on wise ears. Commander Goodman, we have trouble! What's wrong? It's the enemy! They've launched a full-scale assault! Tremendous force. We may not be able to hold the line if they keep this up. You seemed okay up to now, though. What happened? They have begun using mithril ammunition. Mithril? About a year ago, the enemy captured the mithril mine we were working on. There was something in my journal about that, come to think of it. Let's see. Uh, here it is. Mithril is a hard metal refined from mithril ore. Mined in Eisenberg. Over 80% of all mithril in the world is mined in Eisenberg, where it is said precious orichalcum has also been found. Orichalcum is a precious metal unique to Eisenberg and the hardest material in the known world. It can be used to produce weapons and armor of the highest strength, and it releases great energy when melted at high pressure. We tried to recapture the mine, but the sword bearers had put children to work down there. Children? Yes. I'm sure you've heard tales of canaries being taken into mines as an early warning for dangerous gases. Well, the sword bearers call the children they've abducted and forced into hard labor canary boys. When we tried to rescue the children, those cowards used them as human shields and barricaded themselves inside. Using these canary boys to warn of danger? I cannot believe the Black Blades would stoop to such tactics. It's despicable! We can't let them get away with it! We must do something to save the children! What are we waiting for, then? Let's take back the Mithril Mine! <sighs> the mines are crawling with sword bear soldiers. It would be foolhardy to rush in without support. Even so, we must take action. You can focus on retaking the mine. We'll rescue the children they're using down there. Oh, wait. What can I help you with? What do you mean? The enemy forces attacking the bridge. Oh, I see. The shock troops led by that brassy young woman. Our intelligence suggests she is a high-ranking member of the Black Blade. That girl is one of their officers? Don't underestimate her. She uses the power of song to bolster her soldiers and weaken ours. The power of song? Yes. Her songs can be quite troublesome. All of our soldiers that hear her sing become confused. 
The sword bears bombard us from the opposite bank when they see us in disarray. We've suffered great losses from these attacks. Songs that inspire allies and confuse the enemy. She must have quite a voice. I'd like to hear it myself sometime. So it doesn't bother you that she's a foe? I hope her honeyed tones send you tumbling off the bridge. I have no ulterior motives, I swear. So, if you silence this girl, would that swing the battle in your favor? Unfortunately, she is protected by a formidable force, and the narrow bridge makes it impossible to get close. Then... Three leans over ice cream is this girl's name. I wonder if we're going to end up getting a singer job Are class for that. Able to break through? If it is beyond even you, then we are out of options. If only we could shut her up. What can I help you with? I see. We gotta wait. Oh, you know what? It's probably an option outside. It's, uh... It is. Okay, so this is taking us to... Probably gives us the answer we need to beat her. Hey, have you ever heard of Siren Song? I have. A strange voice you hear out at sea, right? Sailors who hear the song become captivated by it and throw themselves overboard. It's a common tale. That's right. The siren song that causes all to cast themselves into the sea. When I was even younger than you are now, there was a time it was heard throughout the whole ship. A siren song? 
Was everyone okay? It caused great panic among young and old. But a traveling bard who happened to be aboard said something that calmed everyone down. All you have to do is sing above the siren's voice. <laughs> Brilliant, isn't it? He conducted us in song with his baton all night long. And the siren was defeated. Wow. That's quite a story. Where did the bard go? Uh, who knows? He set off again soon after. One of the elders here might know. Meet a pupil of his in Unshine. It was a conductor throughout the lands. We were blessed to learn songs. Pupil and Anshine. I think that's where we came from. Guess we gotta go to Anshine. Must be where the pupil is. This I indeed was under the first pupil. Sally, I fear he has crossed the great divide. When he, knew, when he knew he was not long for this world, he sought to visit three of his pupils one last time. He passed on to me one of the secrets to his singing. His last words are always sing with your mouth wide open. The second pupil he visited, I believe he lived near the castle and calls it called Dysia. <clears throat> Like we're heading north.
As you look from a mentor, it seems it's been some time I heard his name, such memories. As I was a second pupil. When he came to see me, he looked fondly at my children as if they were his own grandchildren. Now they're all grown up and I'm an old woman. Uh, you wish to know why I'm giving instructions? And you can do sing from your belly. He said he stayed with me for a few weeks, then set off for his third pupil. He lived in Flora on the land of radiant flowers. Okay. Port up here, we can just land. This is a... Uh... I'm assuming that's just a grinding area. This is because we can't even get around from right here. So we got to go all the way around. Must be up here for some form. Yep, right there. Oh, it's the one that was on that stage the whole time. Or was it him? This house is last people. Was that surprise you? You expect a woman, no doubt, me being from Florum. I can see her face. In any case, my mentor visited two other pupils before coming to see me. He bestowed one of the secrets to the songs to each of us. You wish to know what he told me? Well, this is embarrassing. He said, do not be shy when it comes to the song. He always worried that I was too faint of heart. I'll never forget the words he whispered to me when he left my side for the last time. A singer has no need of finesse. He said he was heading to a harsh child as he left. Okay. Yo, whatever we get from this quest line, I hope it's worth it.
So we gotta go right back all the way over there. I mean, it's only right that it ends where it started, so. Should be the end of the quest line, and we can go right back to the main story. Mines? That's right. The shield bearers asked us to rescue you and your friends. The shield bearers? But I'll be in trouble if the guards catch me slacking off. You don't have to worry about that anymore. How many other children are there in the mine? There are 20 of us on duty right now. No, make that 19. Thank you. You go and hide in that shed with the others. Okay? Got it. Hey, what are you doing in here? That means there's 16 left. The shield bearers asked us to come and rescue you. Okay. Oh, what the hell?
You gotta remember it's the, it's a side quest in here still. Only fourteen more to find. The shield bearers asked us to come and rescue you. So to find 12 more the shield bearers asked us to come and rescue you thanks should be I don't know if that's all the ones on the bottom floor it should be all the ones on the bottom floor I'm pretty sure they're gonna have some more on top floor too all right just tend to go the shield bear then 